reunited and it feels so good. Prince Charles and Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, are marking a major milestone on Thursday. 15 years of marriage. The pair tied the knot in a civil ceremony on April 9, 2005 at Windsor Castle. To celebrate the big anniversary, the royals are spending it together at their Scottish home. After being apart in self-isolation due to the coronavirus pandemic, according to People. Camilla came out of self-isolation on Monday. Despite not having COVID-19, she had to remain in isolation for 14 days after her husband tested positive for the virus, which was revealed on March 25th. According to People, the pair reunited right after Camilla came out of her self-isolation period. The Prince of Wales came out of self-isolation last week, seven days after he was diagnosed. While the couple was self-isolating, Camilla was on one side of the house and Charles was on the other. But that didn't mean they weren't there for each other. Quote, both of them remain in good spirits. There is a sense of keeping calm and carrying on. The Duchess is concerned for him, but she is aware of her own good spirits and therefore is keeping a close eye on him and mindful of her own situation. A palace source told people at the time. Prince Charles's mom, Queen Elizabeth II, recently addressed the nation about the severity of COVID-19. I'm speaking to you at what I know is an increasingly challenging time. A time of disruption in the life of our country. A disruption that has brought grief to some, financial difficulties to many, and enormous changes to the daily lives of us all. Together we are tackling this disease, and I want to reassure you that if we remain united and resolute, then we will overcome it. I hope in the years to come, everyone will be able to take pride in how they responded to this challenge. And those who come after us will say the Britons of this generation were as strong as any, that the attributes of self-discipline, of quiet, good-humoured resolve, and of fellow feeling still characterise this country. The pride in who we are is not a part of our past, it defines our present and our future. 